The Scream by Paul Flores. It all starts with Robert wanting to go to the beach because he really likes the beach. One of the sights, tastes of the pure food, sounds of the awesome waves, and the smells of the salty ocean, and the feelings of the soft sand. Man, I can't wait to go to the beach and go on the pier. I love the smell of the salty ocean, said Robert. So when everything seems like nothing can go wrong, Robert got a flat tire. Oh man, I'm never going to go to the beach now, said Robert. But then he saw a store. Yes, a store. I hope they sell tires, hoped Robert. Robert reached the store and there were two very creepy men named Isaiah and Manuel, and it smelled like something died in there. Um, hello, said Robert. Do you have any tires for sale? Robert asked Isaiah and Manuel. Yes, we do have tires for sale, said Isaiah and Manuel. Both at the same time. Okay, can you show me where they are? Please, asked Robert. Here they are, said Isaiah and Manuel. So Isaiah and Manuel hooked up the tires and Robert drove off. Beach, here I come, said Robert. Wait, isn't that Isaiah and Manuel from the, from the store on the sidewalk, questioned Robert. No, I must be losing it, said Robert. While Robert kept denying it, he kept seeing Isaiah and Manuel. It was only increasing it in his mind that they were real. Okay, I'm probably hallucinating, thought Robert. As Robert thought he was hallucinating, Robert kept seeing the men, so he gunned it and drove out to the beach. I can't get Isaiah and Manuel out of my head. They were so creepy, exclaimed Robert. While Robert was thinking and thinking about Isaiah and Manuel, he saw them. You too. No. I, you're not real. Yes, we are, Robert. We're, we're real because we're ghosts from your future, explained Isaiah and Manuel. No, exclaimed Robert. Without thinking, Robert just stabbed the two men. And right then and there, he had solved his problem. I have to throw their bodies in the ocean, thought Robert. So Robert threw their bodies in the ocean. There, that is done. So Robert just resumed his normal day at the beach. Well, that's that. Look at those awesome waves, exclaimed Robert. Check it out, a hot dog stand, said Robert. One hot dog, please, asked Robert. Certainly, said a weird-looking man. Mmm, said Robert. Hey, what what happened to your chest? It It's bleeding, screamed Robert. I'm fine, it's just a little flesh wound, said the man. I'm okay, said Robert. Thanks for the hot dog. Mmm, pretty good hot dog, said Robert. Wow, this hot dog is warm. It feels nice in my hand, said Robert. I love the sound of the waves, said Robert. Mm, hey, look at the self-portrait maker, said Robert. Hello, how much were a self-portrait picture, asked Robert. The man making the self-portraits was old, and he had tattoos all over him, thought Robert. Um, can you make me self-portrait, please, asked Robert. Yes, that would be ten dollars, please, said the man. Okay, here you go. Hey, you look familiar. Have I seen you some before, asked Robert. Um, no, said the man. We'll post for your picture, said the man. So while Robert was posing for his picture, he saw Isaiah and Manuel walking on the pier. Ah! The man said, yes. That's perfect. Hold that screaming pose. And that's how the screen picture came to be.